Okay, so what we're going to do here is going through just Prim's algorithm, um, which is just a process of how to get the um, minimum spanning tree on a connected network. The great thing is you can pretty much start at any point. It doesn't actually matter where you start. It'll sort itself out. So if we just pick a random point, like right in the middle here, what you do is you highlight or trace the edge that is the smallest. So you're always looking for the smallest possible connected edge. So in this case, the smallest edge is 40. So we'll highlight that. And then from there, um, we want to connect the smallest edge that is already or that is connected to a highlighted node. So in this case, we look at both ends because they're now both highlighted and the smallest number that is connected to either of those is 50 between these two. So again, it won't matter which one we choose. So let's just go with that one there. And we're going to just keep doing that. So here now I've connected a 40. That's actually the lowest possible number connected to any of my blue nodes. So I'm going to connect that. Um, and again, now what's the lowest number that I can connect? Um, these have 60 and 70. I can beat that with a 50 over here. And then I can do a 50 over here. And now that's everything connected on that side. So now what I'm going to do is uh, check how I can connect these other points. So a 60, 70 doesn't beat it. A 60 is tied. So let's just go with that one because there's no better option. Um, and now suddenly 40 is the lowest connected to all of my blue. So I'm going to go with that one there. And then finally, I'm just trying to connect these three. So I've got 60 to get to there. That's probably the shortest. And then here are 60 and there's no other option there to get to that last one. And there's my minimum spanning tree. You can pretty much repeat this. You can make up questions by just drawing a random network and putting random numbers and practice that process for yourself. But that's all we have to do to get a minimum spanning tree. Prim's algorithm.